Hi, fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. <clears throat> Each zodiacs are going to have their own readings, one zodiac at a time. So, Aries, this is your deck of cards. Aries, for those of you who's new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button. Smash the like button and comment down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell because I am doing live sessions. And during the live, you can ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. If in case that you missed the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. That link will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. And if you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. It felt like to me, Aries, that things are happening over and over and over again. It felt like you are in a loop, right? Um, your person is going to ask you to forgive them, do the, you know, do the same mistakes. Um, ask them again, another chance. Um it felt like it's tiring if i will be in that position it's it's really tiring to be something that you felt that your person is not learning lessons right or it could also be you right probably you're doing something the, the process here is you're doing something over and over again right um although it takes you to tango that's why round and round right then doing the same thing you doing the same thing of trying to forgive them kind of i'm not saying that you don't have to but there's no changes in approach um there's no plan or strategy um so that your person can also change um willingly right um aries with the page of cups the hermit the tower, the full card, the ace of wands. It felt like to me, um, for a few numbers of you, this could be a same-sex relationship, okay? Um, if this is not a same-sex relationship, there might be some age gap. It doesn't have to be May, December love affair. It could be a year older, two years older, right? Um, if this is not the age gap, then someone thinks maturely, someone thinks otherwise. Um, kind of, for a few numbers of you, this is also a new um, chapter, a new person. You're trying to become a bigger person here. F for some of you, you uh, it started as a hookup. You know, there's something already happened intimately. Now, I told you, it's, it becomes tiring for you to be able to get this 10 of cups which is the stability with it which is the concrete foundation as well uh, for those who are in separation whether it is physical or energetic it felt like to me it's hard to put things back together right although you wanted to but how can you if the history repeats itself, right? Um, with the five of ones in here, the ten of cups showed up. I, I love this because it showed up twice, which means that both of you wanted this together, but there's always a fight. There's always a competition uh, with the way how you speak, probably with the eight of ones in here the two of cups and the wheel of fortune i want to know the competition first all right aries is it a competition with your person or is it are you do you feel that you are competing with a different energy mm -hmm. with the six of wands in here and the three of swords Let's clarify here the Eight of Wands as well. Eight of Chalice and the Ace of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. I felt like this energy is in and out. Not the restaurant, but more of the situation. Um, you're kind of like hurting because of 
a broken promise, if I may say. Um, but there, if this is a broken, yeah, broken promise, that's why it's going to kind of round and round. Believe me when I say, um, even though that you wanted to turn your back in this connection, the love is still there. I want you to know that there will be a brand new promise in here, which is something big. Is it going to happen? Yes, with the Wheel of Fortune in here and the Two of Cups. But it may take time because the Virgo card is showing up, right? Now, it's up to you if you want to stretch your patience. But knowing Aries, you might be bullheaded, but this person might change you in a lot of ways. So the zodiac signs that I'm seeing here, water placements, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, uh, Virgo, Leo, Pisces. Is there any... Oh yeah, I'm seeing here Earth Science Taurus Virgo Capricorn. So this is your reading Aries. Let's proceed to Leo. Alright, give me a couple of sec. So let's clean this for you, Aries. Leo, this is your card. For those of you who's new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, smash the like button, comment down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell because I am doing live sessions and during the live you can ask me questions. If you miss the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link. You will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. If you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. So Leo, for those who have a new um, person in their life, a new apple of their eye, it felt like you wanted to admit something. There's already a push that you wanted to open yourself up to them the emotion well it could be legs what have you right it doesn't matter and there's no judgment in here but it felt like to me you kind of wanting to feel the warmth in the connection uh for those who are in a relationship it felt like to me that is there an announcement in here of tying the knots, mm, the world card, one thing's for sure. This connection is heading towards to a new chapter, a clean slate, right? Knight of Wands, Eight of Pentacles, the Sun, and the Page of Pentacles. I think that there's no rush in here, um, even though that this is a new connection. The thing here is, the energy is not too fast, not too slow. Both of you are working on this connection, or one of you are working on this connection. And it, it felt like to me, the investment, there, the, there is a right investment in here that kind of, you, you know, if you are having this, um, what do you call the insurance, right? Um, it felt like to me, it, it, I'm going to use or um, describe this in metaphor, that is some sort of insurance. Um, it is really, the interest is really, the interest that you're going to get in this connection is something lasting, right? Um, there's no bad in no bad bad cards in here that we need to clarify, but we need to check other cards. Let's see. Um, seven of Wands, Ten of Wands. There you go. This Thrand card, which is your card, Leo, Page of Wands, and the Four of Pentacles. Mm. Is it just savings, or someone is someone were depriving? Uh, the other person that was then past tense right um, it felt like there were a little hardships in this but whoever 
kind of putting the connection at slow moving and um, a slow moving pace is because they have a plan, a, a bright plan in here. With the Nine of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups, it felt like to me kind of like you're going to think them if they are the one who kind of put this connection a little slow or if you are the if you're the person who's putting this connection in a slow moving pace you're going to thank yourself here because this is some sort of the plan works and kind of this will become a lasting relationship the zodiac signs that I am seeing here it could be a placement in your chart, your person's sun sign, or a placement in their chart. Um, Leo, Taurus. There's a lot of earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, water placements, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, dominant Leo. So this is your reading. Thank you so much. Leo, you might be connecting with the same sign. Let's proceed to Sagittarius. So Sagis, give me a couple of sec. Alright, Sagis, this is your deck. Sagis, for the for those of you who's new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, smash the like button, and comment down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell, alright? Uh, because I am doing live sessions, and during the live you can ask me questions. Even in case that you missed the live sessions, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click the link, you will be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. If you want to book a personal reading, there's also a link in the description box. Um, sad cheese. It felt like if, if you are in a separation, I think it's much better that way for now um, because things need to cool down. Um, the emotions are heightened in a bad way, right? Whoever, whoever decided to walk away for now, you know, to have some peace so that the energy cools down, I feel like there is, that that is the right thing to do. With the Three of Swords in here, it's not just... I think whoever separated, whether you or your person, they are also hurting. Queen of Cups, this Thren card, the Six of Coins, and the Five of Coins. Um, they don't like separating with you, that's for sure. But because of the heightened emotion, they need to. So that, let's say, that there is a crack in the vase so they don't want to add pressure so that it won't going to really break right at least the the crack is the crack is there but the, the vase didn't break right um three of swords <coughs> clarifying the three of swords is the five of wands and the six of swords so which means that this is really the right decision right because of the fight we need to cool it down five of coins someone felt like okay this is the end of it but no just so you know that both of you have it may not be verbal but there is an oath that we were going to stick with each other right with the seven of coins in here, the temperance, the eight of cups, I told you, the ten of swords again, and the devil card. Let's clarify the devil card in here. I felt like there's also a bit of codependency in here because the eight of swords showed up um, underneath the devil card. The king of chalice and the temperance showed up twice. It felt like to me that there is a battle here, battle of energy, um, playing thug of war, who's more powerful. I think that this separation needs to happen so that, again, things need to cool down 
and both of you have a clear mind so that both of you can compromise even the both of you are turning each other's back um, the love is still there the cups in here are still intact you know um, there's no reset cups um, temperance in here both of you are going to try to test the waters again um, all you just have to do is to wait a little but this regeneration needs to happen it felt like you know if I'm going to speak in metaphor it's kind of like a great flood it might be messy chaotic as of the moment but the plant is going to you know rise up again the dove is going to see the uh, the plant um, things are gonna be like the garden again so kind of like the distraction is needed so that you can build something new um Sagis, the zodiac signs that i'm seeing here can be a placement in your chart your person's sun sign or a placement in their chart uh leo is here um water placements cancer scorpio pisces taurus is here there's uh capricorn so earth sign taurus virgo capricorn water placements cancer scorpio pisces sagittarius you might be connecting with the same sign temperance showed up twice this is your reading thank you so much love and light to you namaste see you in the next reading goodbye